Completing a DIY project with conduit and connectors can be a fun and rewarding experience, but it's always important to remember to build safely. You wanna make sure to stop and think through some questions. It all starts when you're getting ready to build. Jake here has all of his connectors, parts, pipes, and everything he needs to build. Let's see what he does. Jake obviously isn't thinking about our first safety question. Could I trip? You always want to clear out as much space as possible when working on your project. Not only does it make the build process easier, but it also keeps you from tripping on pipes and other things when building. Oh, I obviously didn't think that through. That's right, Jake. Always remember to think first, which brings us to our next safety question. What are the hazards when building? These can come from improper tools, carelessness, or from just not thinking. In this scenario, Jake has an idea for cutting conduit quickly. Let's see what he does. I need to cut some conduit. Do you mind if I borrow your chain? Let, let me stop you right there. No. <laughs> way to go, Dave. That's the way to think about hazards and safety. Here are some other common hazards that you want to watch out for. Sharp edges on pipe ends can leave you with a nasty cut. It's a good idea to wear gloves when building and debray your pipes after each cut. You also want to watch out for imbalanced pipes that could fall and hit you or someone else. Keep pipes out of the way and stable until you need them. If you're using power tools like this portable bandsaw, make sure to follow the instructions for proper use and wear any applicable safety gear like glasses, for example. Another hazard may be straining yourself if you try to do too much at once. Remember to take breaks and ask for help if you need an extra hand. When building, you also want to ask yourself, is this idea intelligent? In this scenario, Jake wants to test out a conduit trebuchet that they built. Let's see what he says. You have a ball or something, like a small ball? Well, good thing Dave thought it through and responded with this. Dude, my house is right there. Good job, Dave. This is also an important time to think about conduit. Like any material, it has its limits, so you always want to think about your builds and ideas to make sure they're safe and smart. That brings us to our next question. Is this necessary? When building, it can be tempting to avoid using some pipes or pieces altogether. It's always important to know how the connectors work and make sure you're using them correctly for the best results. Lastly, you want to ask yourself, am I keeping calm to avoid situations like this? What do you mean, no? Take your time when building, and if you get frustrated with something, step away for a few minutes and come back. Always remember to build safe, and most importantly, think. See you next time.